dignitaries. Aunties Ray and Rachel. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. Jen Dobre. I'm sorry, my pronunciation is normally horrible. I'd like to congratulate Kosciusko Heritage and the Jindabyne Aero Club for all the hard work that they've done in organising today's celebrations. Today's Moomba Festival provides a valuable opportunity to celebrate the history of friendship and collaboration between the Aboriginal and Polish Australians of the Snowy Mountains region. The idea of Polish Aboriginal fraternity flights over Mount Kosciuszko and the adjoining region it's a, it's a great idea really, a very creative one, a very unusual one and uh, as part of, this, of these festivals uh, called usually Cozy Fest or under different names over the moon but this year and so I would like to congratulate uh, mainly and personally Ernestina uh, on Ernestina Spuriat Kozak on this wonderful idea. It only, it only remains to wish you all a great day and I hope everybody enjoys the flying and either as passengers or watching the show. Thank you very much. The most important passenger on that flight is Auntie Ray. So please be ready. I'll finish with the names in a moment and all the passengers please gather there next to the plane. She will be escorted there and be ready and you've got to be seated 20 minutes before the takeoff. It was a very good experience. We had a very nice views. We flew below the clouds, so you know we have a we had a very clear view on the Kosciuszko mountain peak. We saw very clearly people there waving to us, and um, yeah, uh, very good aircraft, very nice weather, very good conditions. I really enjoyed it and I enjoyed going over to all the mountains, Monero country, because it was wonderful to go overhead to see part of my country and my remembered all my elders that used to live in the mountains many years ago. But we haven't left. Our Monero people are still here and we'll go on living in this area for a very, very long time. Because I got my younger generation, my grandson and my great granddaughter, and it goes down and down and down. And it's always been a, a long length of family. And uh, I think the thought of going over that mountain uh, remind me of all the old people that used to live up in the mountain. Oh, yes, it was beautiful. Good, beautiful scenery, and I enjoyed every moment of it. They wonderful pilots and, and beautiful gentlemen.
Kosciuszko is your mountain too. It's mountain for all Aussies and visitors too. Whatever you do and whatever you believe, it's a mountain that reminds us that we're lucky to be free. It's a mountain which unites us and excites us from within. It's a place no one cares about the color of your skin. This mountain invites us in a very special way. It's a spirit of Kosciuszko that lives on unto this day. Snows have melted and the sun warms the rocks When the pretty mountain flowers show off their coloured frocks Turn round happy faces up to endless summer skies Touched by the gentle wings of a heavenly host of butterflies A to powiedziawszy pokazał im ręce i bo Uradowali się zatem uczniowie ujrzawszy Pana A Jezus znowu rzekł do nich Pokój wam! present in the flights and throughout the festival was the late John Hospodarek. It was fitting to hear his voice singing about Kościuszko and Strzelecki, evoking unity, fraternity and togetherness, feeling so strong that, can you believe it, even the helicopter joined in with the dance. Otherwise, nobody else can talk. <laughs> okay, all right? Okay. You happy? Now, this you can open the chat. Any, any time you want. You can slide your window open, get air or not, get air, whatever you want. The mountain looks different when you fly over it. It's not like when we usually come as during the, during the um, snow times and it's all white. But this time to look at the Look at the mountain and the lakes. It was just um, 
remember the the times they've had the bushfire that comes through, the trees are all burnt and dry. They're only coming back to life in the last few years. I enjoy it. I never thought we'd ever fly over the tops of all that cosy and, and see and the rest beyond cosy. And we look look forward to catching up probably next year when you have the next Oh, great to hear. Next yes. year. We'll come along. <laughs> We'll just, we'll just come along and say hello again. <laughs> it was very fun. Another Narigo friend decided to fly along with our Consul General. So we've got yet another one extra flight. Cessna with Michael Fisher. So Mr. Groman, Doris Payton with her granddaughter. I'm Doris Payton. Uh, as you know, Auntie Rachel is my mother. And uh, on my mother's side, I'm Nagarigo. And I come up here often with my mother. I love this country too. It's my country of my great grandparents and of my ancestors. My main job, I'm a manager of an education unit in a TAFE college. And my main background is in education. I also have a passion and an interest in history, so I do a lot of writing about history as well. Uh, a lot of family history as well as local history, um, mostly in Gippsland, and I teach a lot of community people about culture and history in our country and language. Over the Moon Bar, an idea conceived by the festival organisers to foster a spirit of togetherness, of brotherhood and sisterhood. Day to action, Polish and Aboriginal fraternity flights over Mount Kosciuszko in three light planes and a helicopter. Local pilots Michael Fisher, Ian Funnell, Mike Roberts and Paul Duncan from the Jindabyne Aero Club donated their time and talents. Ten flights in all including the Honourable Peter Phelps, representing the Premier of New South Wales, and Polish Consul General Daniel Groman. Yes, indeed, Father Miller. May we always walk together, whatever our background.